سٹونس and you, i have visited that place myself also and beautiful homes very big halls they have carved in, in you know in granite uh, rocks and the rocks are very strong they are they are standing up till now although i think they are at least 3000 years old rather 4 or 5000 years old the same time as of harappa and as of mohenjo daro that is one time in which these civilizations were flourishing throughout the world that is the time of samud because much before ibrahim ibrahim alayhi salam was nearly 4000 years from today so before him so actually they are 5000 and you know they remnants you know they are they are present there so this is the samud and when the samud also went on the wrong, wrong path then allah sent to them hazrat saleh alayhi salatu wasalam wa ila samud akhahu saliha and to samud we sent their brother saleh qala ya qaum ibdullah ma lakum min ilahin ghayru the same the, the same call you must be bondsman to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you have no lord except him qad jaakum bayyanatu min rabbikum a clear sign has come to you from your lord they demanded it show us a miracle this you know this rock a pregnant she camel should come out at once from it like a ball from the blue and it, this miracle was shown to them qad jaakum bayyanatu min rabbikum This clear miracle has come to you from your Lord. Hazihin aqatullah. Now this is camel of Allah. She camel of Allah. Lakum ayatan, and it is a sign for you. Fazaruha, leave it alone. Taqul fi ardillah, that it may graze wherever it like in the on the earth of Allah. Wala tamasuha bisuin. Don't touch it with any ill intention, bad intention. For ya khoda kum azabun alim. Then you know a very painful torment will overcome you. Waskuru is jada kum khulafa min baad e aad. And just remember, after the aad were destroyed, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala made them, made you the successors after aad. Wa bawa kum fil ard, and He has established you in this earth. Tat taqhidu na min suuleha kusura. In the plains, you are you are building palaces and fortresses. Wa talhitu na jibala buyuta. and you are carving out homes in the mountains in the rocks now because those palaces they have vanished 5000 years they can't be seen now but the homes that they carved in the rocks they are still there and you know you can see the the pictures of that marana madudi has included those pictures in his tafhim al quran and you can find it in so many places faskuru ala allah so you must remember the bounties of allah that have come to you wala taasu fil ardi mufsidin and don't and don't go about in the earth making mischief qala al malaa alladhina astakbaru min qaumihi the same reply the chiefs of the nation said to him lil ladhina sudifu liman amana and they said to whom to those who people who were oppressed and they had believed in hazrat saleh alayhi salam just as the slaves of makka it is actually a mirror is being shown to what was happening at makka at the time of muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam history is repeating itself whatever you are doing today the chiefs of aad and chiefs of the qaum of the nation of nuh and the chiefs of the people of saleh they have all been saying the same things they are, they have all been doing the same things so they said those haughty people said to those people meek people who had accepted the faith of hazrat saleh atalamuna anna saleh al mursalun bi rabbi do you know do you believe that saleh has been sent from his lord qalu inna bima ursila bihi mu'minun they said you know yes we believe and we we believe in all that he had been sent with qala alladhina astakbaru inna billazi amaltum bihi kafirun and they replied with arrogance and haughtiness Okay, then what you believe in, we deny it, we repudiate it, we reject it. For Akarun Naka, and they killed the she camel. 
and they defied their Lord's command. وَقَالُوا يَا صَالِحْ تَلَا بِمَا تَعِدُنَا إِن كُنْتَ مِنَ الْمُرْسَلِينَ And they said, O oh, Salih, now bring to us that punishment that you said, that if you kill this, if you touch this camel, this sea camel with any bad intentions, a very painful torment will come over you. So bring it now. إِن كُنْتَ مِنَ الْمُرْسَلِينَ If you are really a messenger sent from the Lord. فَأَخَذَتْهُمُ الْمَجْفَتُ So an earthquake took over them, overtook them. فَاسْبَهُ فِي دَارِهِمْ جَاسِمِينَ And they became in their dwellings lying dead in prostrating conditions. فَتَوَلَّا عَنْهُمْ He turned his back to him, to them. وَقَالَ يَا قَوْمِ لَقَتَ بْلَقْتُكُمْ رِسَالَةَ رَبِّي And he said, Oh my nation, oh my people, I had conveyed to you the messages of my Lord. وَنَسَاتُ لَكُمْ And I wanted to advise you sincerely to save you from this disaster. وَلَكِنْ لَا تُحِبُّونَ النَّاسُحِينَ But you don't like, you don't love those people who advise you sincerely. وَلُوتًا In the same way we sent Lut alayhi salatu wassalam. Now he is a contemporary of Hazrat Ibrahim alayhi salam. Hazrat Ibrahim and, they, and Lut were related. He was nephew. Hazrat Ibrahim was the uncle of Lut. And Lut was nephew of Ibrahim. And Hazrat Lut was sent to these, this Transjordan area. Now to today Jordan. This is the area intervening between Palestine and Iraq. This was the area. There was a very big civilization over here. And two very big towns of Sodom and Gomorrah. Amura they called in Arabic and English Gomorrah. Gomorrah and Sodom. Sodomy. Sodomy is from Sodom. Sodomy. Because this was, you know, the most heinous thing that they were doing. Well, Luther is called a Qawmihi. And we sent Lut also. And he said the same thing. And al- along with that, those things, in addition, he said to his nation, Are you doing and committing such a shameful act which no nation had done before you? This is the most shameful. What is that? You approach men sexually. Mindunin Nisa, leaving aside women. Allah has created women for you. That is the nature. And you are approaching men, males, for your gratification, sensual gratification, sexual gratification. Balantum Kamu Muslifun. No, you are people who have exceeded all limits of decency. But there was no reply from his people. Illa an qalu akhrijuhum min qariyatikum innahum unasun yatatakharun. They said, oh, turn them out from your town. They are very pious people, very clean and very pure. It was a satire, you know. They are very clean people. They shouldn't live with us. Turn them out. Fanjainahu ahlahu. We saved him and his family. Illa mraata. Except his wife. Kaanat min al-ghabirin. She was among those who lingered behind, who remained behind. And then we sent a rain upon them. Matra. And that rain was of, not of water, out of stones. A rain of stones came. Fanzur So see and look what was the end and result of those people who were guilty. بارك الله لي ولكم في القرآن العظيم ونفعني وياكم بالآيات وذكر الحكيم